Welcome back to Picture Healer channel. This is Shi Tian. Today we want to talk about common dreams and analyze meanings of these dreams. The first category includes dreaming of yourself flying up or down, falling down from a very high place, or traveling by different transportations. To analyze a dream, we have to look at the whole picture, what exactly happened during the dream and all the details. But there are some basic rules in general to help you analyze. And if you are flying upward in your dream, that's a good indication of your luck is going up. And that's a very auspicious dream, meaning it's a good time to start something new. Whatever you are planning can have good outcome. And on the opposite side, if you are flying downward, that's an indication of your luck is going down. So you have to be more conservative and be careful when you are starting any new adventure or if you have any big plans, maybe it's time to slow down. And the speed is also an important detail. If you fly up or fly down slowly, it can predict the speed of the progress of the luck. And a very similar dream is about falling down from a very high place. That can indicate your business or career going downward or facing some kind of obstacles. Dreaming of falling downward indicating changes in your business and depends on the outcome. At the end of the dream, if you are injured or hurt, that means you are going to have some type of damage or negative outcome for your career. But if you don't get injury from the falling, that means the outcome is still good. You will not be harmed in any serious way. Another common dream is traveling by different types of transportation. You can be traveling by train, by airplane, or by a boat. And depends on different type of transportation, some of them can bring you to your destination very fast, like airplane, and some can be very slow when you travel by boat. So that's also the indication of the speed. Since our life is a journey, so this is a very symbolic interpretation of the journey you are experiencing or you are going to experience. It can be a smooth ride or you can experience some type of trouble or delay. If there's a delay in catching up your train or airplane, you have to look at the cause of the delay. Is it because of your own fault? because you don't keep track of time or because your personal problem or is it just because of the transportation company's fault? If it's your own personal fault, you have to be careful about the possible problems in the real life to avoid any delays. If you miss the bus or train or airplane, that can be a reminder that you have to change the direction. The old way might not work as well as you like, and it's time to change to a new direction to avoid any delay or problems. Another common dream is feeling frozen. When you feel you want to run away, but you cannot move or you cannot run very fast. And that's usually just an indication of your luck. Even if you work very hard, but you feel stuck, that can indicate that's not a right time for you to start a new project. Everything has its own time and place, and the dream of being frozen or stuck can be a reminder for you to slow down and think through your direction again. Another similar dream is being chased and you try to run away, but somebody is chasing you from behind. And that can indicate trouble or conflict with other people. So we have to look at more details to interpret the dream. Why are you being chased in the dream? Is it because of your own fault? Because of your behavior or your language? Or is it because of other people's fault? Is that because of your friend's trouble and you are just being dragged into it? 
So we have to remind ourselves not to repeat this type of mistakes, maybe improve our behavior or character and control our emotions so we don't get into trouble. And if the trouble is caused by other friends, be careful with any projects that involves other people. So be careful about investing or starting business with other people during this time. The next dream is being lost. If you are lost in a dream and cannot find a way out, that's an indication of you feeling lost in real life. And depends on the ending of your dream, did you find your way out at the end or you never find a way out? If you can find your way at the end, that means you still have progress after being lost and sidetracked. It can be your career, business, or any areas of your life. You can feel lost and not having a clear direction. And again, this is a good time to slow down and re-examine your current situation. The next dream is about light and dark. You might find yourself in an area with very dark lighting, either artificial light or daylight, and that's an indication of Lord luck. And your outlook is pretty dark during that time. And on the opposite side, if you dream of yourself in a very bright space with bright lighting, that's an indication of good luck. And it's a good time to start any project on your mind. The next dream is about the shoes. Sometimes we dream of very old and broken shoes or the shoes don't fit you. And the shoes are symbols of your journey. If you have problem walking in your shoes, that means the journey you are going to take will be difficult and with different obstacles. And depends on the story of your dream, it can be related to a certain part of your life. The next common dream is about your old company or old environment. If you dream of your past company, that can mean the history is going to repeat. Whatever happened in that environment before can happen again soon. If it's negative experience, you might want to pay attention, maybe change your temper, change your habit to have a different outcome this time. The next dream is dream of other people's name or the name of the road or name of the locations. If you see any words or names, they all have symbolic meanings. Depend on what you are worried about during that time. You have to analyze the whole dream and whole story. And the names can provide details. Maybe it's the sounding of it or the meaning behind the words that can be associated to some key details to solve your problems. And how do you feel about those names? Your emotion can tell you the relationship between the name and your story. And we can examine the meanings of these names in our real life. Next common dream is about taking exams. It's a very common dream and it can have different meanings. In your dream, what is the result of your exam? Did you pass the exam? and feel confident about the exam or did you fail it and feeling very anxious or stressed? The dream can reflect your personality, your habit, and the progress you have made over the years. If you pass the exam in the dream, that can indicate your positive progress in the real life. If you have problem passing the exam, that can be a reminder for you to study more or keep improving yourself for the best outcome. The last common dream is about teeth. Teeth are usually related to our family members, especially the health of the family members. It can also signal any conflict, quarrel or fighting with your family member. 
So depend on the dream, you have to check the health of your family member and also try to avoid any conflict or argument with the family member during that time. So those are the 12 common dreams and the basic analysis. I hope it gives you some ideas to interpret your own dream and find a different perspective for life's problems and the solutions. Thank you for watching today and talk to you next time.